it's Dallas McCain alongside Smoke and Joe Lasher, and we are out at one of the many festivals that Ingalls sponsors. We are next to the Ultimate Air Dogs. You're going to hear generators. You're going to hear dogs barking. Yeah. Things are going on. That's this all the fun. We're, out. we're outside. Yeah. But today we're going to do something that probably a lot of people question. What am I going to do with all these leftover Easter eggs? Well, we used to hit them with a baseball bat <laughs> or see how many trees we could hit. But if you don't want to do that and you yeah. find yourself with an abundance of hard boiled eggs. Right. This is my, a good way to do it. We always did because my mother would always boil a lot so that we would have a lot to hunt, you know? Yeah, right. So. Well, you're a lucky gal. <laughs> <laughs> so look, this is a little trick I learned a long time ago. I love this trick. I got a little warming pan. We're just going to press these eggs right yeah. through there. Look at that. It works so good. Watch how fast this goes. You it. hold that yeah. and just watch how fast this you guy goes. You don't need to chop eggs with a knife. You can do this right here. It's yeah. so easy. And again, and it makes them very, uh, makes every, you know, all the eggs the same size. That's exactly right. Yeah, why chop with a knife when yeah. you've got a warming rack? And I picked this one up at Ingalls, yeah. to be honest with and you. that's all it is, just a warming rack. Yep. Slide your eggs through, chop them right up for you. That's it. And we've got all the good stuff to go in our egg salad. Celery, onions. That's muffins. right. So I got a couple, about one and a half celery stalks. Oh, yeah. Give it a right. little crunch. Some green onion. Yep. Fresh green onion. I've got some yellow mustard. We're just going to oh, pour that yeah. right in there. But you know, I like to say it all the time. Put whatever kind of mustard yeah, you want. Whatever you want. You know, let's use. Uh, we got about three quarters of a cup of mayonnaise. Boy, I bet it would be good with sriracha mayonnaise too. Oh, wouldn't that be so good? Too. Little spice. A little yeah. Spice in your egg salad. Yeah. There's and something then, great to do with all those leftover Easter eggs. Right, and then I've that got the whole family can enjoy. A couple of tablespoons of fresh squeezed lemon juice. Need a little salt and pepper. Salt and pepper. Let's put it in there. I like a lot of salt and pepper, so there we go. There we go. And here's what I'm going to do. Since I have my glove on, I'm yes. just going to go ahead and mix I do this the same up. Exact thing. Mainly because I forgot my spoon. Yeah. This is the best spoon you can have, but put a glove on. Eh, you know, <laughs> if you're serving other people. Well, yeah. For sure. <laughs> well, I don't like to get it under my fingernails. I mean, so but I look, look at this egg oh, salad. This looks so good. I mean, are you kidding? I think a little more pepper. I like to see it. Yes. I'm a pepper guy. Uh, me too. I love it. Oh, you know what else I've got over here? Check this out. What we got? Some smoked paprika. Oh, I like it. Okay. Like on your deviled eggs, yes. right? Absolutely. We're gonna mix that in. I'm gonna save a little bit to garnish the sandwich with. But we're just gonna build one right here. I got some fresh croissants. From, from the, the Ingles. Bakery. That's right. And you know, you could grill those, toast yes. them, or whatever. But I'm just going to take some of this egg salad. Look at this right on here. Yes. Oh, just my like gosh. so. Look how good that looks. And then look at here some fresh smoked paprika. Fresh smoked. <laughs> smoked paprika. Smoked paprika. I'm one of those people I don't like to throw anything away. So I love this kind of recipe. Look, there it is. To waste. That is how you can use your leftover Easter eggs. That's it. Thank you so much for joining us. We'll see you next time on the Ingalls Shopping List. Yes.